Hey, what's up, guys? This is Chosen Thos streaming uh, Nine Hours, Nine Persons, Nine Doors. Uh, some of the footage got corrupted or something. Something really weird happened where it played, like, all of our audio up front and then silence for, like, it was overlapping each other, so it was, like, Animal Crossing speak and then just nothing for a bunch of minutes. Uh, but now a ton happened. We did some banter on the menu, um, and then, uh, we got out of the room. We were in a hallway, um, Seven put, uh, some stuff to block the door and said that, um, said that maybe he would want to play some piano, uh, is why he blocked the door. Uh, so they could get back into the room, and he said he wanted to play some piano. Uh, and honestly, and, and then, yeah, pretty much we go down the hall, and it picks up from there. So, uh, yeah. No way to know, no way to know if they're working or not. You can't reach them. Of course they're working. Why would I put elevators on a boat that wasn't working, dumb, dumb? I don't know, because it oh. looks nice. There's a door just to the left of this gate. I mean, look at this. It's like a little fancy gate thing on the elevators. That's cool. Yeah, that's because that is so that they can't leave the playpen. Oh, of course. You don't know that playpens come with bars often? But why would an elevator get out of a playpen? No, these people, you uh... stubborn elevator. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can be a Don't little bit want, dumb. You can't let the kids out of the playpen, so you put up the bars. But you're the otherwise kids, they will get. Uh, otherwise they will get in trouble. But you're baby. And I will have to punish them. With death. Yeah, with death. Okay. Punish with death. All right. Sounds like it's locked. Oops, sorry. They're getting down. They're blocked by the gate, though. Uh oh. But this here seems accessible. Oh, I yeah. I like the, the art of all the backgrounds and stuff. It's very nice. Thank you, I do it all myself. Good job, Zero. So we can open it? Hello, Viewer One. Hello, Viewer One. Welcome to Zero. I mean 999. No, you mean 989. <laughs> 989. Yeah. Uh, I think it's locked, too. Look. But you can, there's a key. What's this mark? The female symbol? Yeah. Oh, uh, the Venus symbol, I imagine. Too bad none of us are Venuses. Uh-huh. We have a lotus. You... That kind of sounds like Venus. I meant, too bad none of us in this group are females. None of us may enter this gate. Oh, uh, Okay. You recall the similar symbols near the large central staircase? They reference many of the solar bodies. Okay. Oh, that's right. Ready I to, remember now. You ready to flash back to them? Here they are. <laughs> Done. Wait, I don't remember that. When was that again? The Saturn. Uh, it was a What were these? Um, they, they were locked doors. I think this one was for an elevator. Uh, oh. And the other one was a locked door near on the floor with that we are still on, I think? The... F it was... Or maybe it's a different floor. I'm not sure, but it's a locked door somewhere around here. Okay. Yeah, there's another off door somewhere around here. Oh, I remember that. I tried to explain to them that that wasn't a symbol of Earth. That was clearly the symbol of a crosshair. Yes. Correct. It is clearly a crosshair. So, as you can see, that one is likely the female symbol. Uh-oh. I mean, not the woman <laughs> symbol. For the Venus symbol. It can be both. So I assume. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hold on, where's Seven? I'm over here. Yeah, there he is. Way down that hallway. This way, Snake, follow me. Hmm. I wonder if this door will open. Mm. How about it? It opens. Wow. It's almost like doors that don't have a lock on them open. No way. Oh, hey. Are we oh, in the puzzle room? Oh, oh wow, we... we're in a casino. We're in a casino. We're in a really old-timey casino. Really tiny casino. Let's go. Is this some kind of casino? Yes, we already discussed that, you and Pay. Yeah, Keep every up. cruise needs a casino. You up yourself. Sure looks like one. Well, this is troubling. It seems we are once again locked in. Ooh. I think it's an escape room. Even if the door is open, it's not like we had anywhere to go. That way. So we must find another exit, then. Okay, so like, I remembered this being an escape room, but I didn't realize it was now. Like, I thought, <laughs> I thought it was like, later on, then it is. Oh well. Alright guys, let's split up and search this room. And seek a way out and do the little pew, 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 pew. Seek a way out. <laughs> that. Come on, no drama. What? You'll see. I don't understand. You'll see it in a sec. Uh, let's go quickly now. Yeah, there we go. Pew, over there and over there. Oh, and over here. Oh, and over there. Oh, whooper terrible. And then, and, and, oh, seek a way out. I shall find a way out. As soon as I get, regain my senses from the out of body experience. Mm hmm. Why is there a camera? Because that shows it all the time, every time, for some reason. Let's go forward. I don't think we can go forward. And let's go left. Okay. Now let's go forward. How? It, it, there's no forward button. Do you, like, what do you want me to click on? And let's go left. Okay. Forward. <laughs> There's still no forward button. Then let's go left. Okay. Forward. Love you to point out the button for me. Fine, go left. Forward. <laughs> Unfortunately, there was no forward button in the game. <laughs> okay, then let's go look at that vase. Vase. Vase does nothing. Let's go look at that clock. Mm. Oh, I guess we did go forward. Good job, you figured it out. <laughs> I applaud you. Thank you. Alright, we are now behind the bar. We are now at the bar. Alright. Babies aren't supposed to drink, so it's all just apple juice. Okay, sure. Alright, um, click on the thingy on the thingy. Please be more specific. Click, click on the thingy on the thingy under the other thingy. Uh, can you see my cursor, by the way? No. Oh. Huh. Click uh... on the note paper under the beer that is apple juice that huh huh playing card we got a playing card number four yep i am number four uh no you're number f wait yeah no you're number five i am number four clover is number four fine because of four leaf clover. Alright. I'm, I'm sorry, I know you want to be number four, but it's simply not so. Fine, I'll just tear it up and throw it away. Uh, I don't think there's a button for that. Oh, Here, right, because we tried it in the last. We tried it in the last escape room too, but it didn't work. I can do this. We Let's... tried to throw something away in the last escape room too, but we didn't know what it meant. Mm -hmm. Go back. 
Okay. All right. Look at the beer. Let's st let's study the beer. All the beer. Oh. Uh, the on the if you meant on the shelf, um, on the on the, I'm pretty sure those are just glasses, not beer. Or maybe they are beer. I don't know. Either They're way, apple juice. They're apple juice. They're apple juice. Anyway, I clicked on the two bottles to the left instead of to the right. No. I'm sorry. I thought that's what you meant. Well, will you look at that? Someone left a bottle of apple juice here. Don't mind if I do. Glug. 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 Ah. Ah, oh, it hits a spot. Feels like my throat's burning with apples. Wow, he really drank it. We don't even know how long it's been there. Not very long. Alright, so Seven is now drunk on apple juice, so actually you want this. Oh, okay, there we go. There's a whole lot of glasses on that shelf. Doesn't look like there's anything else back there, though. Alright. Alright, different shelf, then. It's just one shelf. Click on a closer shelf. And does nothing. Yeah. Fine. Click on the playing card. Not that one. There's something on the counter. <laughs> That's all I saw. There's a four right next to it. Oh, the playing card in our inventory? Looks like a card. A playing card. Seven. I am number seven. No, seven is number seven. I'm number eleven. I don't think there is an eleven. There's only there there's is... only nine people. Well, no, but if you add seven. them, but if you do the digital route, then you're two. But that's I'm sick. two. All right. It's stealing all my cards. It's stealing all my numbers. Well, I'm sorry. Shame on them. Yes. Shame on them. Go back. Okay. Oh. Now, what play card were you actually talking about then? Four. Oh. The one, the one in the inventory. Maybe. Okay. Cool. Something cool is happening when you do that. Yeah, it switches items that you use. All right. Click on the beer. That's really apple juice. The two bottles on the table. Uh, yeah. Okay. There's a bottle with some apple juice in it sitting on the counter. One more sip. I don't think so. I'm cutting you off, pal. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. That's a doggy. <laughs> Now click on the other thing. What other thing? That other thing. I, I ended up clicking on the counter, I guess. <laughs> the counter's pretty well polished. Well, that's good. Now click on that thing. Please be more specific. Okay. Please, uh, that specific thing. Uh, uh, th this action could not be taken because the computer did not recognize that thing as an object. Oh. Napkin. That just is part of the counter. Vase. Nothing. Door. That Door. is part of the counter. Oh. There's nothing else of interest over here. Okay. I'm back. Let's go. Click on the chair. All of them. What? Okay, why are we at the table now? I don't know. Pick up the card. <laughs> number five. Oh. That Now you are number five. Well, you did it. We did it. 
we did it. Okay, good. Let's see what we did to cart. All right. There isn't a throwaway button. Did you throw Yoda seven? Okay. I'm gonna go back. Unless you want to do something here. I just wanted to search every card. Oh, okay. The seven of spades. The five of spades. The four of spades. Ooh, good. Mm -hmm. Let's head out then. Oh. Wait, no. Combine the cards. Make it the 16 of spades. Nope. Well, that's dumb. Why didn't that work? Uh, I don't know. Everyone knows if you shove two cards together, they become bigger cards. Yeah, if you glue two cards together, it becomes a different card. <laughs> Obviously. The spades just appear on one of them. They yeah, they don't fusion. do this. <laughs> yeah, they fusion Ha into a, a bigger card. Fusion Ha? Huh? Yeah. It's the Dragon Ball, my, Dragon my, Ball thing. It's Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball may have come up with it first, but Steven Universe also does it. Yes. I could have referenced that as well. But everybody references Dragon Ball Z because that's where the idea came from. Yes. <laughs> Although there's been, you know, fusions of things before Dragon Ball as well. Yeah. Like Voltron. I was thinking the one with the the fly. Where what? You go in a you go in a teleporter with a fly and you get mixed up with it. it I that's don't... different. That's sign. That's using scientist stuff to fuse things together. Yeah. That's not the same. Just being like we're buddies and then it's randomly becoming a thing by joining together. Well, oh, okay. Sure. One uses science, one is just weird. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now what? Did you know that Bell fused with a Pokemon? Yes. Yes, I did. And then you unfuse him and leave the Pokemon forever locked up and earn that Bell out? I guess so, yeah. Huh. <laughs> Sucks for them. Now I back up. Okay. Now what? Look in the chairs. It's a chair. It is a chair, isn't it? Yep, totally a chair. It feels like a chair. Nothing more. Nothing less. I love these. I, I love these little things where it's like, what do you think, dum dum? <laughs> All right. What about the ones over here? No, okay. This, this is- oh. This is just a chair. There's nothing else to say about it. What if I do it again? Uh, no. Kabo, Kabo. <laughs> yes? Everybody turn right, right, right. Okay, let us turn to the right. Everybody turn left. Okay. To the left. Click on that red thing. The red, uh, this one? We're back in the bar. What? No, why don't you look at the red thing? The... What red thing? That one next to the bar. I did, it took us to the bar. I didn't want to go to the bar, I wanted to go to the red thing. Try again. Okay. It took us to the bar. <laughs> You're not doing it right. Uh-huh. Fine, turn left. That's the wrong way, turn the other way. Okay. Go back, I saw something cool. Alright. Go forward again, go left, right again. Okay. That's where that was left. Are we good now? The screen's messing up, I keep seeing a golden treasure chest. I don't know where you're seeing that. 
it's when the screens are flashing, it's like lagging for half a second, and you're seeing what you're not supposed to, and when the screen flashes one to the other, it's like putting a different scene in between for some weird reason. That's very strange. There's no treasure chest, I assure you. <laughs> okay, let's light the wood. <laughs> let's what? Oh, the fireplace? There's fi firewood in the fireplace. Yeah, I said light it, Cabo. With what? We don't have fire. The fire is right next to it. There Click is on no the fire. Oh, okay. Well, at least this one isn't lit like the other one in the first class cabin. I'm trying to light it, though. Maybe that's why it feels a little chilly in here. That's why I'm trying to light it. Click on the chairs. This chair goes to the poker table. Mmm, it feels really soft. Kabu's just like <laughs> rubbing the chairs. Mmm. Hmm. Click on the light box. Uh. If the. the nope. Click on the big lantern. This? Click on the light bulb. Click. Click on the other light bulb. Hmm, wait. When those two lights turn on, I heard something from the bottom of the fireplace. Ooh. Oh, what's that? I just turned on the two. Not done yet. Mm. Click on the, oh, the. Oh, the mirror's made those. I see. Now click on the weird thing. Weird. In the center. I really. I don't. I don't know what it is. Just click. Oh, it's a playing card. Oh, okay. Clubs, diamond, and hearts. Oh. What's that? Well, when I turn on those lights, they make the shadows on the canvases. And the shadows look like three symbols, right? Yeah. Hmm. Clubs. Diamonds. It's pretty neat, huh? Playing cards. Playing cards. Huh? Didn't think I'd find a card here. Six. What do we have now? We have four, five, six, and seven. Uh, nice. Yeah. Four, four five, five, six, and seven be twenty. Seven. Okay. We also the digital have wood, a full house. The digital wood is four. Well, don't we also have like, isn't this a full house or something in poker? How should I know? There's something in car, it, like poker, something I, where you called can... full house. There is something yeah. called full house. And I don't I'm know pretty what sure, it is. I'm pretty sure it's it's ha or having the ones in a row. I don't know. Whatever. I don't know. I don't know enough backwards for this. This is a very empty house and it's a boat, not a house. You know what? You're right. Let's go back. <laughs> now what? Click on the cool lighting. On the, the picture or the lamps or the glass? Glass. The light on the right side is lit. Ooh. The light on the left hey. side is lit. What are you clicking on? The lamp itself. It it gives like a yellow outline of what I click. Do you click see? on the mirror. <laughs> okay. Do, do you see the yellow? You see the yellow, right? Yeah. Yeah, that tells you what I clicked. I know. Okay. There are three symbols being projected onto the canvas. Starting from the left, we've got clubs, diamonds, and hearts. We're missing one, though. Yes. The one that we have in cards. Go back. Oh. I guess it... Why Get did it. that turned off? What? Grab it. Grab, Grab it. it. Okay. Woohoo! <laughs> Casino coin. 
bad. Hit, 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 hit. Okay, there are a whole bunch of coins stuffed into this velour bag. No, that's where they went. My coin. <laughs> My gambling coin. No. <laughs> Look at all these coins. Pathetic. <laughs> these coins allow us to convince the machines to move. Okay. Oh, it just says casino back. coin on both. Let's go back. Let's turn to the right. Let's click on that thing at the far end of the hall. Oh, hey, look forward. <laughs> okay. You could so move forward the whole time. Alright. Click on the number nine. Mm-hmm. Put the two there. I don't have a two. Put the two there. I don't have a two. Put the two there. You do not have a two yet. Fine, let's just back up. This thing is dumb. Okay. Let's go through that door. Dang it! This isn't supposed to be working out the way I expected. It's locked. <laughs> you, it? you thought you could just get out of the escape room and that the door wouldn't be locked. No, there. he didn't. He said it wasn't supposed to go the way he thought it would. Which mm. is what it's doing. Is there a keyhole? If there is, I can't find it. What the? What kind of escape room has a keyhole? One where you have to find a key? Well, there must be some way to unlock it. How unoriginal. <laughs> Let's kick it down. Let's look around a little more, shall we? Let's shall. Alright, now what? Back up. Mm-hmm. Turn right. Mm-hmm. <coughs> Click on the pretty pictures. Mm-hmm. Check out that stained glass. I do it myself. Very good. How beautiful. What? Huh? Stained glass with colored piece of glass placed together in a frame. As I've said many times before, I need only touch it. No. I can at least discern the basic structure. Okay. They got the stained glass again. The stained glass is recessed into the wall. All I can see in there is light fixtures, though. Probably oh, means. It. What? What? Probably means the stained glass doesn't look outside. It's just pretty. Oh. Then click on the chairs. There are some chairs. They seem perfectly normal and cherry. That's totally something good, Cavu would say. Totally Mmm, cherry. Click on the stadium. Well, I, do you want to click on some of the other chairs, or do you want to just... Yeah. Click on all the chairs. Okay. What about this one? That one doesn't do anything. Those do, though. There are four chairs surrounding the square table. Wow. Click on the square table. That square table. It looks like a mahjong table. Do you play mahjong, Seven? Uh, no, but I know to call it Mahjong and not Mahjong. Uh, maybe? I don't remember exactly, but... I do remember a couple of hands and some of the rules, so I figure I must have played it at some point. Excellent. Once we've vacated this vessel, I should like to play a game with you. Oh? Can you, uh, play? 
So long as you tell me which house I am eliminating, yes, I have believe I have enough skill to defeat an amateur. That's mean. However, I must ask you to remove the red tiles when we play. Uh, I don't get it. <laughs> Click on the table again and maybe you shall. It does look like a mahjong table, but I think this is probably for poker. Hello, Cap, you're gonna make them mad at you. There's nothing on it. It's what on the podium. Well, can I check this table first? The one that's right in the corner? Near the Fine. camera? Oh, nope, that just turned us. Okay. You said the podium? Podium. Okay. Alright, grab the card. Mm-hmm. Three! Ooh, so we have three, four, five, six, seven. We don't have two or eight, though. We're looking for two more cards. Mm-hmm. Go back. Oh. Now, put some cards on the table. Right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Click on... Yeah. Wow, this place is, like, super amazing! <laughs> What's this place for? Probably for playing Baccarat. Looks like a little off though. Yeah, look at the middle of the table. There's something mounted on it, see? Uh, okay, click the middle of the table. The what part? There's two things that- there's the multicolored thing, there's the glass thing. What do you, which one? Both at the, the same thing. time. I can't! I can't click both at the same time! Then go to the dice. Alright, how about this one? Ah, Baccarat. You ever played Junpei? No, never. Alright, then how about I explain the rules to you a bit, because we're about to play Baccarat. What? Yep. See, Baccarat is kind of an unusual game. You've got the banker- What did you click on? What have you done? I clicked on the glass thing. Oh, okay. It said roll a dice, so I just picked the bottom one. That's another dice. But there weren't any dice. <laughs> You've got the banker and the player, and the whole point is that you, uh, guess which one's gonna win. And whether the banker or the player wins, it all depends on their hands. The way each hand works is different from other games, too. So you take the number from the ones place after you add up the value of all your cards. And I work in the one place. What? So if you have, like, 12... You take the two, I think. Oh. Whoever gets the number closest to nine wins. If your number is smaller than your opponent's, you lose. Ooh. Well, that's it. That's the explanation. Got it? Well, actually. Okay, let's go. Well, actually, there's a lot more to it strategy, details, that sort of stuff. But what I just told you sums up the core of the game pretty well. The single digit of the sum of all the cards you have. The strongest hand is a 9. And the weakest hand is a 0. You just ignore the numbers in the 10th spot. You get it? Yeah. 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 Maybe half of it. Enough! I got a chance of winning the game if I play it now! However, we have no way of knowing if the puzzle in the back of the table makes use of those rules, and if it does, in what matter. And I guess we try everything! Alright, now we can play Baccarat, and it's an 8. Do we want to make a eight. digital root of 8, or do we want to beat an 8? Neither. Okay. Uh, okay, maybe the second one. We're gonna make it so that we have an eight. We probably have to make an eight. 
Look at that card. Okay. We have five, six, seven, three, seven? four. Do just do seven, six, and Ooh. five already. Okay. Uh, okay. I'll make seventeen. Which is this? Which would be totally useless. Yeah, that wouldn't beat an eight or equal an eight. Hey, Stephen, are we supposed to play Baccarat? <laughs> it's a Baccarat table. What else would we do? Huh. Yeah, stop worrying about it. It's real simple. What's the opponent's hand? Well, there's an eight in that glass case. Alright, then that's your opponent's number. If well, that's the case, what three cards do we need to get that number? Two, get... three, and four. Three cards? There are a couple indentations with li 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 white lines around them, right? Those mean we gotta pull down three cards, so... Two, three, and four. Say three cards and defeat the point eight. That's what I've gotta do, I guess. Yeah, I think so. Hmm. <clears throat> Something tells me those aren't the only rules. Gosh. Alright, let's give it a shot. Two, three, and four. Now. Before I start, I'd better make sure I got the rules straight. Uh, no, I don't care. I don't care. I don't care anymore. Okay. Alright, let's do this try. This game is so... Uh, we, we don't have a two. And we can't play yet. Okay. I don't think. Alright. Let's leave. Okay, I'll pick the other thing as well. Oh, no. It's the back rot table. There is a glass case in the center of it. Okay, that's yes, all we, we can click on this, I guess. Let me Let's check go. the sides. No. No, oh, no, it just clicked that again. Alright. Let's go. Okay. Let's go to the right. Mm hmm. Let's go to the right. Mm hmm. Let's go out that door. Alright. This door is shut tight. It won't open. Let's keep turning. Mm hmm. Let's talk to those guys. That's all we haven't done yet. Alright. Do it. Use a coin in it, you mean? Do it. Alright, let's put a let's put a uh, Alright, let's put a coin from the bag in here. <laughs> what happened? I heard an odd noise. Ah, uh, we put it. We, we're gambling. That's all. Mm -mm. Well, to be honest, I don't know what's happening. I pressed some of the buttons and smacked the machine once or twice, but nothing happened. I could hear a tiny bug. Oh. Oh. Looks like the coin got stuck. Oh dear. Now what? Click on it again. Again! The coins are stuck. Don't Fine. think this machine's gonna work anymore. Then let's go to number three. Give it a coin. Here you go. Soon, Pei, perhaps you should be more careful in the future. You got the coin stuck in the machine on the left. Please don't make the same mistake again. That would be bad. Why? We have a ton of coins. I know that! I know that! It'll be fine. Jerk. I'll put this coin in the slot. I'll put this coin in this slot. That'll show him. Uh-huh. Yeah, but what did you do? Alright, uh, that's weird. 
Do you intend to lock us in here? It's not my fault, it's Cabo's. We're going to start stuck on its own. Ha ha. Cabo's help. Ha. Oh boy. <laughs> well then. One more time now. Give me timbers, give me bones. Let's do number two. The coins are stuck. I don't think this machine's gonna work anymore. Does anything have to be clicked on itself? I know. Itself? Oh. Plate says three. Number two. Oh. Really puppy. Aw, puppy. What's puppy doing? Laying down. Good puppy. Alright. Alright. Let's drop the coins. Ah, this time don't break it, Cabo. Come on, you little guys. I only need one of you. Diamond? It worked. No. Oh! I don't remember. Let's go look. Hmm. Hmm, this is a tough one. And what's so tough, if I may ask? Are you gonna tell us the obvious again? I think he might. <laughs> Hitting these wheels just right. Timing is well. It's not easy. I don't believe you need to hit them just right. Huh? I'm dumb. Explain. Hey, oh, probably explain no, if not. you screw it up again. <laughs> we didn't screw it up though. We just backed up. I know. Back up again. Go, go look. Let's yeah, go look. Yeah, I, I know Rather. what you want to do. Right? There we go. Club Diamond Heart. Club Diamond Heart. Okay. Back over there. That sounds like, a, that sounds like an interesting... That actually sounds like a club name. Club Diamond Heart. <laughs> Dang it! Time to try again. Club Diamond Heart. Okay. Club, Club Diamond, Diamond Heart. Wait. Wait. It's oh. been. Okay, okay, okay. Club Stop. Diamond Heart. There we go. We did- we got seven, seven, seven! Yes. And I think I hear something unlocking in there. This is a two. Impressive, Junpei. Stop condescending to us, Snake. That was not condescending. Oh. It appears to be unlocked now. There was something akin to a drawer in the bottom part of the machine. <laughs> that sounded like a hood. Poor puppy. Oh, puppy. I just heard her. She laid down. She like... She leaned over and she, she laid down and I heard a thud. Oh no. That is the pickup drawer for a dividend. Probably the lock for the drawer got unlocked. Please open it. If you can mentally do such a thing. If you can handle opening a drawer. I don't know. Is it item? Will item open the drawer? Will menu open the drawer? I don't know. Back up. Will the back button open the drawer? <laughs> <laughs> oh, gee. I don't know. That's not. Let's go back forward again. Click on the two. Maybe that'll open oh. the door. You did it wrong. I know. This is a slot machine. I wonder what the deal is with the drawer on the bottom of the machine. I don't know. Me too. Nothing. There's nothing there. I think the two card. Like I was hope. I knew there would be a two card in here. Yes. What is it? Is there something in there now? Yeah, a playing card. And this. With the Venus symbol on it. Woohoo! We can use that now for the one place we were just at. 
Excellent, Junsei. Now we will be able to open the door. Then we just need to figure out how to get out of this room. Oh yeah. Well that's obvious. You just gotta... Come on, Junpei. Booyah. Yeah, I'm not gonna do any of the work. Nobody except you is gonna do any of the work. Go. <laughs> and he's off. There was a playing card and a Venus key. Better put I the... can see them. Yes. Better put the key in my pocket for later. Okay, do you have you have a pocket cabo? Yes, and the key is this is slightly larger than I am. Actually, it's <laughs> a bit larger than I am. But I'm just going to put it in my pocket. As for the card. Cool. Alright. Thank you. Let's go win at Bakret. Alright, let's do it. Two, three, four. You can see the playing card behind the thick glass in spades. Oops, wrong thing. Before I, I start, too, uh, the rules. Yes, I know the rules. No rules. Okay, two, three, four. Yes. Go. Oh, hello. Two. Three. Four. All right. If I just put down these three cards. Yes, open it for me. Open it for me. Great. You did it, Junpei. Yes, it was all me. Yeah, you think it's still on us? Not at all. Hey, I'm the genius here. You're just carrying me around. You think it's telling us to take the eight card? No. Nah. Come on, let's grab it. I. Fine. All right, let's take the card, and then we have them all. Yes. Oh no, we're missing three cards. Oh. What do we do? Uh, nothing. Cabo, help! Uh, I I don't know. They're stuck on the baccarat table. Oh no. The indents were filled with glue. Oh no. Yeah. No, they weren't. You're weird. Uh, fine. I put glue there. No, you're gonna break the game. Yeah, yeah. Bad bug. Mm, nope, good bug. Oh. Now bug. what? We need those cards somehow. The three cards I put down are stuck to the table. Apple. Oh. It won't be going anywhere anytime <laughs> soon. I glued them there. Ah. Uh, <laughs> if you want, I know the solution from here. Of course you do. You know all the solutions. In fact, I bet that you, Kabu, are in cahoots with Zero. Me? No. Why would I be in cahoots with Zero? You know all the answers because you secretly know all the answers. What? No. Yes, you Me? Do. Never. Alright, now back again. Click on the things on the top. Uh, I already, we got the eight card. Don't need to hang around here anymore. Okay, fine. Let's go. Okay, we have a bunch of cards. Mm -hmm. What's that thing above the painted glass? Is that another painted glass window? It's just more painted glass. Okay. Uh, the stained glass is built into the recesses of the wall. It's actually really beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, turn right. Every time I have to be like, what's directions again? <laughs> okay. Turn right. Turn right. Turn right. 
Trust me. Hey. Turn right. Junpei Turn right. is just spinning in place. Turn right. Turn right. Turn right. Turn right. Turn right. <laughs> oh, jeez. Jun Junpei, why are you just spinning, man? I need a clue. What? There is one you... thing we haven't done anything with yet in this room. That's what I'm looking for. Okay. We have looked at it, but we haven't done anything with it. Huh? We have looked at everything in this room. However, there is one thing that we have looked at, but not done anything with. Beer! No, chairs! There are four chairs surrounding the square table. Where are the other chair? There are some chairs. They seem perfectly normal and cherry. Glass windows. Let's break them. The stained glass windows built into the recess of the wall. It's actually really beautiful. No, turn left. Wrong way. Over here. Click on the tables and chairs. All of them. Square poker table. There's nothing on it. This is just a chair. There's nothing else to say about it. There's nothing on the table anymore. Alright, fine. Let's go look at the beer area. Okay. Look at the beer. That's a lot of expensive glasses. Even cheap drinks that taste great out of glasses like these. Look at it again. There are a whole lot of glasses over here. Look at the other beer now. There's a bottle with some apple juice sit in it on the counter. Look at the vase. Seven looks like he'd like to very much be acquainted with the bottle. No! Seven, stop! Look at the vase. The vase does nothing. Fine, let's back up. Turn right. Look at the table and chair. It's a chair. The seat is nice and soft. Look at the circle above the door. Well, at any rate, this gate is very impressive. It feels like granite. It seems to be elaborately decorated in several places. A shame I cannot see it. Thank Try you again. for that flavor text sneak. That's the door we came through. Uh, it's locked and I can't get it to open. The kind of thing above the door. An elaborately decorated gate stands guard over the door we just came through. Okay, um, look at the fireplace. A fireplace? There's some firewood here, but nothing else. Okay, look at the top part. Look at those. There's a weird looking thing floating in there. Ooh, look at the other one. There's a weird looking thing floating in there. Okay, we already tried all this. Okay, back up again. Turn right. Now we're back where we started. Okay, look at the white thing again. The thing on the wall? Yeah. I know what you have to do here. You need to put the two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. But we don't have any of that yet. Um. Can I, can I, can I, you're really close. Mm, put all the cards there and see if anything happens. Okay. Here's the card slot. Looks like we need to put a playing card in here. Wait, only one? 
What? Uh-huh. What? Yeah. What? Yeah. Uh, okay. Hey. Sure. Why not? You only needed one. <laughs> you only needed the eight. Oh! Now... Now you have a second authentication. It seems we have another device to contend with, yes? There are three slots in this one. Okay, so I always... I, I thought I thought the reason it showed an A and a 9 and a spot in between was because we need 8 cards. I thought that's what we were supposed to... I thought that's, that's why I thought there was 2, 3, or 8. Because because we had one and nine, so we needed in between. I think we're gonna that, need the all of them, and then the last three are these three. Let's and, see. Uh, uh, it's probably a digital. Group. No, stop. Let's see. These last the cards, and there's a nine right below them. So that probably means we gotta make nine with the three cards we put in the slots, right? Right. Just like what we did over at Bakura. Yeah. All right, let's give it a shot. We only have three cards left. Let's yep. give them all. All right. And it's a digital route. Yep. Yeah. All right, so I put all the cards you had into the slot. What happens now? Is that? Yes, I did hear something from the exit. Let's go check it out. Excellent work, Kabu. <laughs> Junpei? Wonderful. You suck. <laughs> <laughs> it seems the exit is unlocked. Let's go. Aw, oh, happy, happy snake. Okay. Door? Door. All right, let's go. Yay! Da -da. You found it! Yay! Whoa. This way. <laughs> we're back where we were before. <sighs> I can go with the Venus symbol. All right. The Venus key should work here. Let's unlock it. Let's see what we got. It sounds like it did. All right, let's get this thing open. No problem. Let me help with this one. I got muscles for days. I got so much muscle. Ooh, we did it. It sounds as though you have opened it. Wait, how do we open it when none of us are girls? You said this was a death game, but you're wrong. There's no death in this game. No one's killing anybody. Well, the one guy We died. should be able to reach through that now, I imagine. That's the one guy pretty much committed suicide by being an idiot. It's hardly a death game. <laughs> death games, we, uh, all the participants have to kill each other. Mm, is that so? Like... Like in World's End Club, and yeah. then... Well, in World's End Club, they didn't kill each other. They tried. They tried, but they failed. And Rachel failed them all. Yeah. Nick, mm. are you going to be alright? I mean the stairs. Can you walk downstairs? You mm. pay. you are an idiot. You pay. he already walked down a bunch of stairs, you fool. Please do not do yourself the embarrassment of underestimating me. I would be unlikely to trip, even if I were running backwards. You saw a snake go downstairs. That's when you met him, was they were running downstairs. I didn't think running downstairs backwards, though. You'd... I'm gonna say running downstairs backwards without tripping. You'd... That'd be it. cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Running backwards and not tripping. I don't know if I could do that. <laughs> Probably could, but like, you know. Good here. Let's move. Downstairs? Running backwards downstairs? I don't think I could run frontwards downstairs without tripping. <laughs> yeah. Everything looks okay here. 
We should check the next deck door down. Just in case. <laughs> Oop, water. I found water. This is what I thought. It. These decks be underwater. Just like the bottom of the central staircase. Uh huh. Oh, hello, viewer two. I'm just glad there wasn't level nice and changed much. Back to sea deck then. How are y'all doing today? We're playing. Hello. Uh, we're playing nine hours, nine person, nine doors. We just uh, got out of. The casino, and now we're checking out, um, stairs. Other places. Yeah. Now, how about we check out what's here? There are two elevators over there, which means it's probably the same upstairs. Hey, look. It's a girl, but with, uh, horns. Girls. There is a card reader, uh, between them. We don't have that card though. And a weird mark. Yeah, we don't have any cards. Hey, check it out. It's a similar Lotus. For Lotus. We gotta, find, we what? gotta go find Lotus. What? See? He's got the woman symbol. And then he's got the devil horns. Right? Yeah, so that's Lotus. <laughs> yeah, I see it. No two ways about it. That was a pretty good one, kid. <laughs> <laughs> and then... Ow! What do you want, man? That hurts. You're gonna break my neck. And then Seven broke his neck. And now it's a death game. <laughs> yeah. What are you talking about? The human body ain't that weak. Maybe this will tell me you up. <laughs> if we were looking for a devil, we got him right here. I am the devil. Yeah. This is the Mercury symbol. The Mark Schumann stuck for horns are a stylized version of the wings and staff of Hermes. Okay. Hey, okay. Wings and staff, huh? Those two upward lines? Okay. So then. He beats you with the staff until you die and go to heaven? What? Junpei. Junpei, buddy. What? What? <laughs> Sounds like Lotus, alright. <laughs> um, then Junpei died. It's a seven. That's too much. My head! <laughs> <laughs> His head freaking exploded, man. I think I'm gonna puke. I think I'm gonna puke. Unless we can activate this device. I highly doubt the elevator will function, or you will puke. In other words, we gotta find a key card with a mercury symbol on it. Correct. So I would assume. But... Let's forget the elevators for right now. Okay. How about that hallway to the left? Well, there's a bunch of doors. Yep, now have fun opening every single one and searching it. Okay. Oh man, we're not gonna have enough time to check all of these, are we? All right. Maybe we can come back here later. We should check on the other side. It's like you're you're still on a time limit. <laughs> Is it five o'clock yet? Uh, I don't think so. Let's head back. Be interesting if you were uh, like. I I don't think it would be fair. Since it's a visual novel game, or it, yeah, since it's, a vi it's like mostly visual novel, but it would be interesting if the game was on an actual nine hour timer. It takes way longer than nine hours to beat. Well, well like, uh, yeah, so if you don't read and solve puzzles fast enough, you just die. To the right, to the right, to the right, to the right, to the right. To the right now the lift, same. now lift. Now give get by yourself. Now get get by yourself. Yeah. Do it do it here too? Well I guess it's only four this time. Let's open. And another hallway and some chairs. Yeah. And those. Let's open them up. Starting with the closest one there. 
Okay, I'm on it. It isn't locked. I'm gonna open it. Hey, go ahead. I'm stopping you. It's just darkness. Oh, of course. Hello, darkness, there my old go. friend. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm, I found some more number doors. Wow. Mm, eh. Hey, what... What is this place? It's... I don't know. So huge and empty. It's creepy. I know what it is. There are beds everywhere! I know what it is because I've seen the game before. <laughs> Abu, I know what you're working with, Zero. No. Is this a hospital? The harsh scent in the air is reminiscent of antiseptic solution. I think so. The shelves in the center of the room are... Uh, the sh there are shelves in the center of the room with medicine and surgical tools. Hey, look, the four doors at the end. Three of them have numbers. Yes. The three. The left door says three. The seven. The second door is blank, but the third has a seven. And an eight. And the rightmost door is an eight. <coughs> There's no doubt, they're numbered doors. Is that so, Junpei? <laughs> Is that so? Junpei is such an idiot. Hey, why is the door between three and seven blank? Does that mean anything? It means it's not a numbered door? No point worrying about it right now. Let's see if these will open first. What? Junpei. Yeah, good idea. Let's see if the rules that were clearly established are broken now. And you can just open the number doors without the scanning thing. <sighs> no way, it didn't open. Oh, that, oh, one, that no one didn't okay. open either. Okay. Wait, you want? No, I meant you want the picture. I can't? Fine, let's keep going. I want to know if there was a thingy next to the one with- a thingy next to the one with no number. There wasn't. Are you sure? I am sure. Oh, right, because you played the game before, that's why you're sure. <laughs> I see. Habu's a working for Zero. Mm hmm Yep, lock. Just like I thought. Abu is my pet bug. Mm. He is my pet because I told him if he doesn't do what I say, I will crush free. Whoa. So he is now my pet. It's that kind of relationship, huh? I thought we were friends. <laughs> but no, you're blackmailing me. Okay. Naturally. Naturally, I'm blackmailing you. After all, there are rules in the new game. And to allow these doors to open easily would violate the rules, you stupid dumb dumb What heads. about the one that doesn't have the thing? What's wrong with that one? Why is that one locked, unless, huh? can, unless we can authenticate ourselves with the red, the numbered doors will... Well, can... can we... no, the only... I'm being interrupted here by someone. Sorry? Who's interrupting me? Whoa, whoa, check this out. Look at okay. the red, there's nothing on it. Huh? Huh? Oh, it's dead. <laughs> it's not dead, it's red, but it doesn't have a display. Don't you remember the red back of the main staircase? If there wasn't anyone in it, it said vacant on the little screen, remember? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, you're right. Uh, but this one, as you can see, there's not, and also nothing is lit up. There's nothing. Right? You think it's broken? Probably not. 
Only one way to find out. Let's scan our stuff. Mm, nope. No bee beeps. No bee beep. You couldn't open it anyway. All you can open is what? A five? Seven? Yeah. Two is not. Yeah, five. You can't open any of these. No, nothing. How about you get into a seven? And door three? I didn't think all of them would be malfunctioning. They're not malfunctioning, you jerk! Everything's going the way I want it to! Yeah, Zero just turned them off for some reason. It's like, don't go over here yet, I'm not finished with the escape rooms. What did it mean? It gotta be broken. They're not broken! Man, I didn't think Zero was the kind of guy who'd screw around with something like this. I'm not guy, my baby. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Zero's been prepared for everything so far. And you're saying he's gonna make a mistake now? Seriously? Well, he is a baby, so I don't know. Maybe. Well, that's the only thing I can think of. This thing ain't working at all. Home. Home. It seems as if some of the internal hardware has been removed. Ooh. In great What is it? What is internal hardware? I don't know. <laughs> that is what I said. Take a look at the underside of the red, if you please. The bottom? Huh? There's a thin slot here. I think it's a slot for something. Probably that planet. Really? Is that so? The other two reds are the same. Something's been removed from all three of them. Yeah, you figured it out. Like a like a battery or something, probably. I don't know. I get it. So the reds aren't working because somebody pulled out their guts. It runs on AAA yeah. batteries. Somebody. I wonder who. Mm, who can No, say? I assume. But why? And who? I mean, it really doesn't make sense. I have no idea. Why on earth would I want to know something like that? I don't know. Someone doesn't want us to go there, probably. Earth Zero isn't ready yet? <laughs> I don't know. I've always been ready. What now? Oh, hi. June! Welcome back. Thumbshoe, Santa, Clover, Lotus. Guess everyone's here. What are you guys doing? Why are you? That's my line. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. Perhaps we should exchange information. Hello. I just remembered something else from way later on, and I'm excited about it. Then you should stop remembering stuff. Oh. Stop it. I, I can't. Brains don't work <laughs> like that. <laughs> and that's all we know. Well, this isn't good. If the red is inactive, we can't keep going. What about that big hallway? Maybe there's something in there we might be able to go. No, there's nothing there. The five of us had a quick look. We checked every single room. Five of us, the five of us had a quick look, see? Yeah, there are plenty more hospital rooms, but nothing else. Yeah. By the way, guys, this is a hospital room. Yes. Oh, by Vera Tuchan. You mean all that those... That was June. That was June, not Vera Tuchan. Oh, by June. This thing... June is to you to Chang because I was watching I mean, and maybe. she disappeared and the moment she disappeared you said bye you to Chan. Yeah, well, that's possible. June herself was watching the stream. You mean all those doors are for hospital rooms? Yes. 
There are a number of different individual rooms in addition to the larger ones, eh? There was a door at the end of the hallway, but it was locked. It had one of those solar system markings on it. It was the Jupiter symbol! Welcome back, viewer 2. Not actually in the chat, but you continuing the bit. Anyway... <laughs> Jupiter, my sworn nemesis. I wonder what it means. It's a planet, Lotus. A what? I've never heard of anything like that in my life. Well, we're, look well, we're asking what things mean. What's the deal with this room? What's the deal with airline food? I mean... I thought this was a cruise ship, but I can't imagine a cruise ship would have a hospital like this. Why not? Well, I figure it's probably a hospital ship. Chances are, it's the Gigantic. You mean the Titanic? Nope. The Gigantic? You ready for some more fun facts? No. Yeah. What is this gigantic? The gigantic. Uh, she was a sister ship to the Titanic, built in the early 20th century. Actually, the Titanic had two sister ships, and they looked exactly the same. The gigantic was said to be one of them. They intended to make her a passenger liner like the Titanic, but, war but World War One began soon after the ship launched. No. Yeah. The British Navy took her over and made her a hospital ship. At some point during the war, the Gigantic was damaged by a German mine in the uh, Aegean Sea. Remember how one of my first things I was saying when you were walking around was how similar it reminded me of the Titanic? Yep. That's very much on purpose. What you said, but then you didn't say anything else. Yeah. Well. You said it's very much on purpose. The end. The end. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's all you needed to know. Uh, she ran aground afterwards, so she didn't end up sunk. What happened to her after that? One theory going around is that a na man named Lord Gordain bought her. Who Lord Gordain? The guy who bought the Gigantic, maybe. I don't believe you. Maybe I bought it. Maybe you're Lord Gordain. I'm a baby. Yeah, a baby can be a lord. You're born into it. Nonsense. Maybe my daddy bought it. Yeah, maybe Before your daddy bought it. Maybe your daddy bought it. Before I killed him. Yeah. The, yep. <laughs> With your baby knife. No, with my electronic masterpieces that do all the work for me. Oh. I just had to program a knife to stab my daddy the moment he walked out of the door of his room. <laughs> program knife. Very good. When I program a tire ship to do my bidding, mm -hmm. I just need a robotic knife that will just attack people randomly. I, I don't I don't know, Zero. I'm sorry for doubting you. About what? About your robotic knife. What's wrong with a robotic knife? I... Nothing is wrong with a robotic knife. Nothing. Nothing at all. Uh... You're looking at my ship and my cool watches. Mm -hmm. And my... Binging and my explodies and mm -hmm. my... You're like, oh, sure! Bombs in the heads! Mysterious blowing up w watches! Mm -hmm. Even doors that need... Magic that need numerical roots. Oh, well, that's fine. But a mechanical knife? <laughs> no way! <laughs> yeah, that's where I draw the line. That's where I, you gotta draw a line in the sand somewhere. You gotta make a statement. You gotta, you gotta look yourself in the mirror and say, What am I willing to put up with today? Not a mechanical knife. And that was a misquote from the Game Grumps. Back to fun fact time. 
Seemed like he'd been one of the few to survive the Titanic sinking. Ooh. That trauma turned him into some kind of a kind of obsessive collector of all things related to the Titanic. That makes sense. Wait. Lord Gordon. You can't have it. It's sunk. Dumb, dumb. Yeah, but he can have the sister ship. Well, then read it so it says that he wants it. No, I'm trying to think because I did a, a theater. I did a, a, a scene. A scene that a student directed. We did, had student directed scenes at the end of the semester um, in college. And I'm trying. And I did something on the Titanic. Um, I did lots of stuff on the Titanic. I'm trying to remember if Lord Gordain was like. In that? Because it sounds familiar, but it's like, does it sound familiar because I just saw it from here, or? I don't know. Soon you enough... did play this game a very long time ago, so maybe you remember from that. Yeah, maybe. Well, I mean, you know a lot about the Titanic. Was Lord Gordain like a guy who was there? I don't know. Okay. Never came up in any of my research, I don't think. Alright. And maybe they made him up. Or maybe they didn't. I don't know. They probably didn't. Soon enough, the guy wanted the Titanic itself. Which was impossible, of course. It stuck at the bottom of the Atlantic Ocean. But the Gigantic wasn't. And seeing as she was identical... Oh, good name. Um, I typed that into Google. Mm -hmm. And there's several things that come up around 999. <laughs> yeah. Are you saying this Lord Godain bought the ship? Yeah, at least I think I am. That's impossible. No way we're in some boat that's almost 100 years old. Did My he... elves would have figured that out already. Yeah, did you see all this stuff? It's like clearly not modern day stuff except for the watches and the reds and the deads. I and don't believe you. the locks. Like the locks are the only Shut modern up, thing. Shut up, Gaia! <laughs> Pipe down, just pay attention. He's clearly rambling on about whatever. What, that's it? Well, have you got any proof? Proof? Proof that this ship really is the gigantic. Oh, uh, well, this ship's got stuff that's like the Titanic and a hospital ship, so I, I just figured. Oh, for good. Don't tell me that's your only reason. No, I've got more. Like? Well, uh, I mean, uh, uh I don't know. I guess your memory isn't back yet, is it? Yeah, uh, sorry about that. Is it five o'clock yet? No. Nope, it's three. You scared my life. I'm sorry. It's not three o'clock. I thought I heard three chimes. If it's three o'clock, that means I only have three hours left. And they start with a lot. Mm. So hopefully they only have they have more than three left. Uh yeah. Well I thought I heard three chimes. I don't I don't know. Huh, a bell. It sounded like the clock in the main stairway. Oh, Ten. okay. Eleven. Twelve. It wasn't done yet. It is twelve. Alright. <laughs> it wasn't done yet. <laughs> it's midnight! Happy New Year! Then we've still got six hours left, right? Oh yeah! Let's get going. We gotta find the missing parts for the Reds. What do you mean, find? How on earth do you propose we do that? Uh, we've looked everywhere in this room, but we haven't found anything. Right? The only- that only leaves one place to look. One. Uh, well, not just one. Huh? 
Mm, the hallway with the million doors. Let's do it. Ooh, wait, don't tell me you mean we need to search all of the other rooms. Makes sense. Well, you already checked some of them out before you came here, right? We each checked a single room, so five rooms in total. You have three months of subscription left. Use them to the four away. What? What's that? Pop up. Okay. <laughs> Alright, then that's five rooms we don't have to search. Ugh. We just have to split up between uh split up the rest between the eight of us. If each of us can do six rooms apiece, we'll have the other forty eight rooms <laughs> cleared in no time. Oh there yeah. Our forty eight other rooms. You're being way too loud. It's like it's like it's almost it almost seems like you're leaning into your mic for some reason. Because it's good and then suddenly it's really too loud and right. getting Thank cut you. off by the mic. Yeah, I was kinda leaning forward, not because of anything, just I don't know. Thank you for telling me. Uh maybe. Maybe what, Seven? Uh maybe there are forty eight other rooms. Alright. We're still here. Alright. So everyone knows which area they're searching, right? Yeah. Yes. And remember, everyone, if you miss something, we will all surely die. Yeah. We need at least one of those working. Our li all of our lives are in your hands. Do not disappoint us. We'll all meet up when the clock goes off again. Aww. How yeah. about in the room with all the beds? We can take a nap. Yeah. Naps are fine. Yeah, that sounds straightforward enough. I'll shout if I find any of the components we need. I hope we can find them within the time limit. If we can't, then we'll just have to come up with another plan. After the time limit, have we gone up? After we didn't find them in time and the time limit ran out. Yes. Uh, yeah. you guys know how to swim, right? <laughs> and let's do this! Run, 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 run. Okay. Now what? Now an hour has passed. We did it. Yay. Is it 5 o'clock yet? No, not yet. Oh. It's one. I better get back to you guys. Not yet. Not yet, Junpei. Back into the hospital room. Nobody found anything. Huh? Uh? Mm? Why are they all standing up in door eight? I don't know. What are they doing over there? Hey, that's what I asked Junpei. <laughs> what happened, guys? Jumpy, look! Yeah, Jumpy. Ah, it's on! Vacant? Come on, guys, who was it? I thought we were supposed to yell if we found it. Well... What the heck? What is up with you guys? What's up? Well, here's the thing. We don't know. Baby did it! Mm -mm. You don't know? Baby! When I got Zero back... did it. Who did it? Oh. Zero did it. Zero did it. Zero did it. I'm sure that is the case. When I got back, it was already like this. There was no one else here. That means I was the first one back, but... The missing parts were already back in the red. What? What? Let me see! You're right. It is in there. What about the other two? No, they're still broken. They're the same. Let me take a look! I don't believe you, you're a liar. <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't believe you. Uh... It's just as you said. 
All right, I just want to be sure here. Yeah? Nobody has any idea what the heck happened here, right? Yes, not even I see, saw anything, Junpei. I was in your pocket the whole time. You were never in my pocket. You were always on my shoulder. Uh, whatever. Correct. 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 None. Mm. Huh? Wait a minute. My hands are really, really small. <laughs> Look at her hands! They're really small! Oh. Where's Snake? Where is Snake? Let me found them. I have no idea. There's nothing to suggest it, but nothing suggests he didn't either. I don't suppose we'll know until we can ask him in person. Well, whatever he did or didn't do, he's pretty late. What is he up to? Maybe he's lost? Mm. Yeah, well that seems likely. Dude can't see. I don't know how he gets around in the first place. Dude, crash you this must. Yeah, he can. Screw you, man. He can get around pretty good. Oh. No, that's impossible. Yeah, my brother is blind, but he's got really great hearing. He can get around as well as anyone who can see. You take uh, you take more you take off you take I see that you take more after your father's best friend than your father, huh? Oh, the point of the <laughs> slamming and pointing? No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Objection! So he... he couldn't get lost. That's impossible. Ah, I'm gonna go look for him. He dead. Hey, hold on, Clover, wait! Yeah, he's probably dead. Well, that didn't work. I have a bad feeling about this. I mean, Dang it, what should we do now? Why else do people go missing in these kind of games? Right? That's... It's a very famous uh, Star Wars quote. Every oh. single movie has someone. Every single movie has somebody say that line. Really? I had never I noticed that. I have a bad that. feeling about this. I never noticed that. It was originally going to be in, the, in Indiana Jones, Raiders of the Lost Ark, the first Indiana Jones movie. Mm -hmm. They were being shot at about the same time. But he couldn't figure out a good uh, spot to put it in. Mm hmm. So he stuck it into a Star Wars movie he was also making at the time instead. Got it. And then he stuck it into the rest of them. <laughs> I see. I see, I see, I see. I too have a bad feeling about this. Dang it. What should we do now? Well, the red is working now. But we won't all fit. No, we're not leaving two people behind. We should go look for them. Oh, man, this ain't good. Oh, yes. What an excellent idea. We just wasted a bunch of time looking for some piece of equipment junk. Now, let's waste some more by looking for a couple of idiots. Then you may here if you feel you must, but there's no time. We've only got five hours left. Yeah. So let's waste let's some get time. Up. <laughs> All right. I'll take this direction. Then I shall look that way. I'll be over there. See you all later. All right, we should go too. Wait, that was not me. Yes, let's go. But where should we start? Let's see. June is with us now. All right, where are we looking? Uh, the large hospital room. Okay. 
Let, let's head back to the large hospital room. That was June Pay. Huh? Why would we go back? That was June. Well, I mean, we might have just missed him, you know? You're Maybe mixing... he really was just late. You're mixing the people up. I guess this is a bit. Oh, I haven't thought of that. Okay, let's go. Right, yeah, it's a bit. You're doing this on purpose. <laughs> Well, I had one say one thing, and then the other respond. It wouldn't make sense to swap in the middle of the conversation. Fine. Fine. <laughs> hey, wait. That's... Hey, Santa. Santa? Santa? I would like a pony for Christmas, please. What should Junpei do? Let's talk to Santa. Maybe he will, maybe we can tell him what we want for Christmas. Okay. What are you doing? Ho ho ho. What? You can't tell. I'm checking out Do Red. Didn't he say we're going that going down that hallway though? Did he? If no, we're checking the hallway anymore. Why? Is there something bothering you? What? It's not bothering you? Huh? This. The guts of the red. Blah, 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 blah. Why wouldn't you wonder who the heck pulled it and put it back in here? Y yeah, that's true. You never wondered about that soon. <laughs> the shocked look on her face implies she did not. No. Well, I'm curious too, but she she's a little she's she's a little scatterbrained a little bit, I think. Who do you think did it? I don't know. Well what about you, Junpei? Who do you think fixed this thing for us? Uh someone Zero. Zero? That's what I said earlier, isn't it? Yes, it is. <laughs> zero. I think it was probably zero. Why? Isn't that obvious? He's the guy who set this whole thing up. Yeah. You don't think that should mean the opposite? Seems to me like he didn't do it. I didn't? Wow. <laughs> wow, Santa, you're so smart. I mean, who do you think took that stuff out in the first place? That was me. <laughs> also zero. I'll be zero. Yeah, exactly. Then why the heck would he put them back in after we'd taken them out himself? To mess with everybody, obviously. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. Just uh, just uh, get a little run around. Waste some time. It, waste some time. It, ju it just doesn't make sense. And I'm Santa. I know sense. Mm -hmm. I do all that work when you could just be lazy. Mm -hmm. I... Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Why would you ever do work if you could be lazy? Uh, so what happened then? Who put that stuff back in the red? It might be fulfilling. So in other words, one of us is the person who fixed the red? Bingo. We have a winner. Yay, what do we win? But if that's true, then the person who did doesn't want the rest of us to know that they fixed it? Yeah. But why? <laughs> no idea. Maybe if they come clean on that, it means we find out something else. Something bad. Something bad. You know. But whatever it is, it's gotta be worth hiding. It's a present. It was you, Santa. 
Ho, 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 Merry Christmas. No, my presents are much more clearly presents and much less creepy mysteriousness. <laughs> hmm. Of course. It could have something to do with Snake's disappearance. Snake is dead. Snake is dead. You think maybe it did something to Snake? Yeah. But why? Look, if you trust anybody in this game, you're gonna lose. Why? Because in this game, it's kill or be killed. Why can't you all just get along? There's literally no reason why there has to be conflict here. <laughs> um, you know. You gotta be careful. The person you trust the most could turn out to be the one who stabs you in the back. But why would they do that? What would they even get out of it? Um... I don't... Uh, <laughs> it's a great question. They've literally given you no reason why you can't cooperate. <laughs> and that's that, I guess. Why are you laughing, June? <laughs> Something happened to Snake. <clears throat> okay. Where should we go next? Ah. Uh, can't finish this. What are you talking about? I guess if you just want to get on with it, you can finish searching. Let's go to the casino. I like the casino. Casino! Let's go take a look around the casino! Okay. To the casino! Hey, what do you think you're doing? Isn't it obvious I'm looking for Snake? I'm just not seeing it. Really? Maybe you need to look harder. I don't think that's the problem here. Oh, by the way, I've got a proposal for you two. Care to hear it? I'm, we're already getting married. You can't marry us. So are we refusing and leaving? No, I will hear what you have to say. I, I don't like skipping things. Okay. What is it? Well, I don't like to beat around the bush, so I'll get right to it. I'm gonna kill Snake. Why don't we team up? What does that mean? Team up? Against... Yeah. Against who? Um, Great question. Yeah. <laughs> what, you need me to explain it to you? Yeah? I'm saying, why don't we go through a numbered door? Even if we want to, that's impossible. Why? Don't be brave, this is 5 minus 6 and you're just 8. A digital rule will be 1. But there's no number, number 1 door in the large hospital room. And it is there, at 3, 7, and 8. Then we add another person. Huh? Who? Uh, the one whose math is... Oh, I know what's, I know what, I know what's going on here. What? I think. She's is... creepily, she's creepily implying that she has the two, number, that she has a number two bracelet. Hmm? What, isn't that Not to be confused with a number two pencil. No, never confuse the two. Isn't that easy? Seven. What? <laughs> oh, you're not being nearly as creepy as I thought, okay. <laughs> you were really creepy there for a moment, lady. Nope. Oh, if we had seven. Five to six, six seven to twenty-six. But this is really twenty-six is eight. Wait a minute. What are the other four? Eight, snake, Santa, and Clover. Forget them. Why don't you add them up? 
10, 1, 1. That's right. Did you do it? Do the floor would be 1. That's right. And you know the number one door isn't in the big hospital room, right? Of course, I know that. See, it's this is really stupid. Oh. It, it's really stupid. What? How? They how? gain not they gain nothing from fighting. And not cooperating means that they lose some numbers. So what if the next door needs numbers they don't have because they left those people behind? There's every reason to cooperate and no reason not to. This is really stupid. Well, this is what's happening. <laughs> we shall see as we go further into the game what will become of them and their non-cooperative, cooperative-ish ways. Really stupid. They yeah. didn't even give any reason for it. They're at least in, at least in Danganronpa's game, they have reasoning behind people not wanting to cooperate. In this game, they're just like, Duh, let's not cooperate because we don't, we're not going to cooperate. What? Is there any reason? No. They just we just don't want to do it because we're dumb. I, I think they just don't trust each other. Us has nothing to do with it. There are, there are eight bracelets. Are you more likely to find a number that you can fit into when you have four people with numbers or when you have eight people with numbers? Was that rhetorical or would you like me to answer? Do you know the answer? Yeah, it's eight. Yeah. I don't know, maybe they're just stupid. What do you want? What do you want from me? I wanted a game that would make sense to have an interesting core cool plot, but this game defaulting into literally being stupid, almost like an idiot wrote it. Oh. Maybe that's I why like Maybe that's why Death March Club is so messed up. I like this game. If they want to have something where a people who are in a group who have literally no reason to turn on each other and who have literally every reason to work together, whether they trust each other or not, just have them suddenly not is literally terrible writing. Okay. Really dumb. Maybe stuff will happen that'll change your mind, and maybe not. Who knows? No, uh, are you saying you'd leave them behind and be a stupid, dumb idiot? Of course not! Why would I be a stupid, dumb idiot? What kind of woman do you think I am? Once we get off the ship, we could come back and rescue them, couldn't we? No, there'd be no time for that. Then we wouldn't really be leaving them behind. Yeah, but you might also not have the numbers you need. Don't try to lie to us. I don't think you do anything of the sort. Really? Why do you think that? You remember, don't you? We have less than five hours left. Even if we managed to escape. There's no way we could come back to rescue them in less than five hours. Well, you never know until you try. No, no. You're not thinking this through. You never be brought seven with us, you wouldn't be able to get off the ship. Are you gonna explain the totally obviousness? Yeah. <laughs> All of us couldn't open door number nine. It is hidden, but the next it can be found. Seek a way out, seek a door to cure is nine. Yeah, that's right. The digital rule for the four of us would be eight, so we'd have to add eight to make a nine. That's right. 
And let's doing Ace 2, we'll be stuck. Oh, hmm, well, that's unfortunate. Unfortunate? That's all you have to say? After your really stupid suggestion? <laughs> well, let's try and find another way, okay? A way to get out of here with all eight of us. Because the ninth guy just... <laughs> that's impossible. Are you being serious? You do know that only five people I know at most can go through one of the numbered doors, right? However, might I, might I uh, point something out that you may or may not have noticed? If, peop if only a certain amount of people go through a numbered door, no matter which group of people go through, they cannot um open nine because their digital route will be whatever one of those numbers is. So if you expect people to go through number nine, then either it's impossible or the other people will be able to meet up with them at some point. What are you talking about? If it's a straight shot from eight to nine, the number eight door to the number nine door, no matter who goes through the number eight door, their digital route will be eight. Therefore, their digital route will not be nine and they won't be able to go through the number nine door. That's literally what Junpei just finished saying to her. Oh. That she responded with, oh, okay, two. And they said, really? Oh, okay, that's all you're going to say? After, and I said, after your really stupid suggestion? Mm -hmm. They were talking about bringing eight along because they needed to bring eight along, but they wanted to be stuck with eight and not nine, and there'd be no way to get through the door. Yes. That's literally what they've just been discussing for the last like, ten minutes. Okay. I was trying to, I thought that... Well, and then you informed them that they weren't thinking of their still and listed what they had just been discussing. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. You know that only five people at most can go through one of the numbered doors, right? The number nine isn't going to be an exception to that rule. Regardless, at least three people will get left behind. Uh -huh. No. So that's why they all betray each other, because not everyone can get out. Yeah, but then they should wait to betray each other until they don't need the numbers anymore. Okay. They can be dumb Not. and have a reason as well. They, they can be dumb. The characters are allowed to be dumb. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure Lotus is supposed to be smart and cunning. I'm pretty sure it's what they're trying to sell her at. Yeah, She's she, supposed she, she... to be cunning, but she is not being cunning. She is being stupid. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Oh no, he's thinking again. No, wait just a second. Why do you always go to the creepy room to think? I don't he's know. He's skipping over a really big detail. Is that really okay? That means three people will die in the end. Are you okay with that? Oh well, yeah, of course she is. Mm. That's, that's just... Well, who's it gonna be? Inconceivable. Do you think I could have a moment alone? There are some things I need to think about. That didn't turn out to be a very pleasant conversation. Yeah. Well, regardless. Let's just focus on finding Snake for now, okay? Yeah, let's find Snake. Yeah, you're right. We can think about those other things later. Yeah. Alright, where should we go next? The hallway with all the rooms. Oh, we can't quit from here, look. Oh, we can only quit in the hospital room. Okay. Yeah. Hallway with all the rooms? Hallway with all the rooms. Let's go. Let's go back downstairs and check out that hallway with all the doors. Okie dokie. Oh, it's Ace. Hi, Hi Ace. Ace. Hey, Snake, where are you? Answer me if you're there. What should Junpei do? 
Gun to Ace. Let's go, Gun to Ace. Hi, Ace. Ah, oh, hello there. Hi, Gumshoe. Nick is. Well, that's obvious, isn't it? He's dead. <laughs> I assume you have found it. You haven't found him yet. Eh, pal? Yeah, that doesn't make you having any luck either. I really wonder where he could have gone. Well, where have we disappeared to? We must find him as quickly as we can. For Clover's sake. Yeah. Hi. What? I'm Why are you now blushing? What, what's that about? I'm blushing now for some reason. As I think about Clover. Oh, okay. Got a thing for Clover, huh? By the way. By the way, do you think Clover and Snake are really siblings? Uh, why would you say that? Well, uh, well, why would you say that, pal? Well, it's obvious, isn't it? Don't really look alike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, now that you mention it, they don't. Yeah. Maybe one is actually Phoenix Wright's daughter. <gasps> what? Still, there are a great many siblings who do not look like one another. It certainly isn't well, say. They could also be adopted siblings. I don't know it. We really must find Snake as soon as possible, say. They they could also What happened to what what happened to Phoenix and uh Mia? Well Mia's dead. Maya, there we go. Oh, uh I don't know. Why would they need to adopt Phoenix and Maya's child? I don't know. What are you implying here? Maybe it will find what out. What is this thing dark lore you're suggesting? Oh, maybe we'll find out in future <laughs> Phoenix Wright games. We can get murdered. Mhm. Mm maybe. I don't know. I definitely didn't spoil anything just now. I actually didn't. <laughs> <laughs> At any rate, we really must find Snake as soon as possible. Say, so let's move on, pal. The clock is ticking. We really can't afford to waste any more time. Da, da, da. <laughs> Very well, let's get back to the church, shall we? <laughs> you can leave this area to me. Bye bye. Mm, bye. That's a uh, lot of ground to cover, but okay. Alright, let's go, Jumpy. Got a lot of ground to cover, Ace. Alright, let's go, Jumpy. Alright. Something about that. Something about that. Uh, I'll think of it later. Okay. Like I said, why is Snake the top priority? Let's go! Alright, where should we go next? Uh, the casino. Okay. Let's go take a look around the casino. We never actually got in there last time. Okay, let's go. Da -da -da. There's no one here. You didn't go in yet. What? Mm -mm. somewhere else. But, how? What? Right. You and Pei, you're supposed we to be in the casino with people. Well, now, now it's blacked out. Okay. The first class cabin. Let's go take a look at the first class cabin, it's really close. What should you and Pei do? Slap her. Uh, I'd love to, but that is not an option. Talk to her then. Are you alright? Hmm. Look, I know you're really worried, but I'm. Um... Alone. Alone. Huh? Alone. Huh? I said leave me alone! No, you didn't. You're so annoying! Just go away and leave me alone! Just looking at you guys is pissing me off! Go away, okay? Just go somewhere else. Stop bothering me. Okay. Eh, ah. Why are you still here? Didn't you hear me? Da da da! Da da da. Fine. Forget it. If you aren't going to leave, then I'll just. Alright, let's go. June. Let's go, June. 
Yeah. She's angry. We really need to find Snake. For Clover's sake, she's having a she's having a mental breakdown. She sure is. What do you think we should go next? Uh, the hallway, the hallway without the room. Hey, why don't we go to the sea deck? We can take it. We can take a look at the hallway without the rooms. We just did that. Okay, let's go then. Ah, da, da, da. Nobody's here. Well, that's not doesn't sound good. Um, he shouldn't have finished searching this entire area already. Mm, he he got tired. <laughs> <laughs> oh where? Uh, let's head back to the hospital room. I think we're going everywhere now. Yeah, I think so too. Why don't we go back? To the Why don't we go back to the big hospital room? Okay, let's go then. I don't think anyone is here. Hmm. What next? I'm just gonna sit here. I'm done. Finish it. I'm, I'm. I'm done searching. I think. I don't think I've got. I can go anywhere else. Onwards. Snake hasn't been anywhere we've searched. We can't keep looking for him. Wherever he is, it's not here. We need to get moving. We don't got a choice. Lotus is right. We're not gonna find Snake. There's a problem, though. We've gotta figure out who's gonna go through which door. Yes, I have a proposal. Why don't we decide on one person to sacrifice? What? Sacrifice? Well, perhaps that's a bit of a harsh word, but yes. You've all figured it out by now, haven't you? We can't all make it through those doors. If we split into two teams of four and three people respectively, then three people will be left behind. If we split into two teams of five and two people respectively, then two people will be left behind. But if we split into two groups of three and leave one person out, then only one person will be left behind. Wait, what? That doesn't add up. Huh? Uh, Why would... What? That doesn't add up. What? Uh, sure, she worked out the math or whatever. Four people can go through one door and three people can go through the other and then everybody will have gone through the door. Will the digital roots work out though? You're saying three people get... Teams of four and three. What is she talking about? Not sure. Wait a minute. Huh? Two people get left behind if split into five and two. And one person left behind if split into three and three and one. Okay. I got that part. You can't go through the number doors with any less than three people. Mm hmm. But if we split into four and three, then why do three people have to be left behind? Just run the numbers. Let's say we go through door seven with one, four, five, six. Who's left over? That would be three, seven, eight. What's the digital group for that? Nine. Exactly, but door nine isn't here, right? That means 378 won't be going anywhere. That was just an example, of course. There are a lot of different combinations, but the result will always be the same. Here's an idea. Head back to that room up there and grab the 9 number. That'll help you guys get all through the door. It's a great idea. It doesn't matter which 4 it is. The three that are left over can't go through any of the doors. Let's see if any of them have that idea. Go ahead and calculate it if you have time. If you have the time, you'll see. Nobody cares about the ninth uh, watch for some reason. Hmm. It's weird. Anyway, that's how it is. 
now if we can get back to my proposal. We only have to sacrifice one person if we split into three, three, and one. Then you're saying we gotta decide who's gonna stay behind? Yes, we do. Given our circumstances, it's logically and morally the best solution. If the other six are to survive, then one person has to sacrifice themselves. No! No, that's too cruel. I disagree. I object. What's so cruel about it? To sacrifice someone like that? Then what's your plan? Maybe we should sacrifice two people instead of just one? That's not what I meant. We shouldn't sacrifice anyone. I told you that's impossible. Wake up. Whoa, whoa, calm down, you two. Yeah, she's not sleeping or anything. Look, what Lois is trying to say is... You should aim to bring the greatest amount of happiness to the greatest amount of people. Right? That's what I do as Santa. Exactly. That's how democracy works. And for that reason, I think the only fair way to decide who will be sacrificed is through a vote. What do you think? No, that's terrible. I'm not asking <laughs> you! Shut up! What about you, Santa? Me? Well, I agree, I guess. Alright, that's one vote for. Counting mine, that's two. Seven. I can't say I agree with you, but... We don't exactly have a choice. If we don't do something, we're all gonna die. Glad to see you get it. If I can get one more vote, then it's decided. What about you, Clover? Hey, Clover. Your brother has to be behind one of the numbered doors. I, no, he doesn't. How would he possibly do that? Mm -mm. He can't go by himself. We searched everywhere, but we didn't find him. Does that mean he has... To, that Doesn't that mean he has to have gone through one of them somehow? Let's go look for him together, okay? If we sacrifice one person, then we can go look for him. You agree with me, right? Okay. Oh, dear. <laughs> the motion carries. Wow. <laughs> now, let's start a vote to... That won't be necessary. Come soon, no. I will stay. That's just our problem, yes? Uh. Ugh. Everyone's shocked. And Ace, what are you saying? No, you can't do that. That won't solve anything. Dude, I'm afraid you have misunderstood me. I said I would stay, but I never said I would sacrifice myself. Huh? I trust you, each and every one of you. I believe you'll come back for me. How? He just does. He the power of friendship or that's, whatever. No, 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 that, that's nonsense. No, it's the power of gumshoot. Power of gumshoe or whatever. He just believes in everybody always for no reason. It's true. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's optimistic and then there's just nuts. Those doors only go one way. You go in, you don't come out. If we go through them. You won't be able to return, correct? Yeah. Cool, but that will not be the case once you escape from the ship. What? Please, I beg you. 
Once you've escaped, come back and rescue me. Ideally, within the time limit they were given us. And if not within the time limit, then please, come back and get my corpse. That way I can be buried in, in Gumshoe can celebrate my death. Wait, that's not quite what I meant. Edgeworth can celebrate Mourn. Mourn my death. My death yes. There we go. No, that's ridiculous. There's no way. We only got five hours left. We don't even know where the heck we are. How on earth are we supposed to find someone to come and rescue you? Then. Perhaps you would prefer to stay instead of me? Or perhaps you would be willing to leave June behind? You see, there's no other choice. Then I say, then I see we've come to a conclusion. Come shoot. Go on. Don't worry yourself about me. Go, quickly. Everyone do the dots. Okay. Good, let's accept his kind offer then. Good, I think this is the best for me. Perhaps I'll be able to take a nap. It may be my age, but I get tired so easily these days. Uh, sleep well, Ace. <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? First Mar Edgeworth and now Gumshoe. Don't care. Edgeworth and Gumshoe go on a cruise. Now both of them are dead. And then both die. We're wasting our time. Why don't we hurry it up? You're right. We should get going. That's all we can do right now. Evan. Seriously, honestly, I was kind of sick of listening to you guys talk. Wow. You too, Santa? Ho, ho, ho. I have to find my brother. He couldn't have made it through. Well, wait, obvious. let's just calm down and think about this. There has to be a way to get everyone out. There has to be. Hmm. Right, Jumpy? Mm. Say something! Mm. Yeah, yeah, let's think. Mm. There's gotta be another way. Fine, forget about it. I'll figure it out on my own. But I agreed with you! What? what? <laughs> yeah. It's like, I guess, I guess Junpei didn't say it very, uh, b believably. Ace. Oh, he's sad now. Ace is sad. Come on, Ace. Please stand up. You can't give up yet. We just have to sit down. We just have to sit down together and think about this. We'll figure out a way that can get us all out of here. Uh. Oh. What? Ace. <laughs> Hi, Ace. What, what, what happened? What happened, Ace? Say something! Oh, not dead yet. I'm all right. I'm all right. How are you all right? This. Mm hmm? A syringe? You didn't tell us you were a druggie. Where'd you get that? What does this do? Super old beta. Did you use this? Yeah, yes, it's an anesthetic. I'll be fine. Freaking super old beta. Anesthetic? I found it. Earlier, while we were searching the hospital rooms, I thought it might be useful later. Huh. I didn't think I'd be using it on my 
myself. What happens if you use anesthetic on yourself? You have uh, you're under anesthesia. <laughs> Why did you do this? What, what do you mean? What happens if it, the same thing if somebody else uses it on you? Which is what? You uh go numb and possibly fall asleep. Didn't I tell you I'd like to take a nap? Yeah, so, he's... I really am very tired. Yeah, so it knocks you out. Hey, is... Huh? Is there anyone say? I'd just like to sleep a little. Could you keep it down, pal? <laughs> no, don't! Ace, don't fall asleep! He already drugged himself. Uh, you feel warm. So comfortable. I think I have a nice dream. Good night. Ace? Ace! Let's get him up on the bed. And then he starts snoring. Well, we really don't have much of a choice now. Why do you look sad? I don't know. You know, you talk, you do, all your fault. Yeah, well, I guess I'm a little upset. We can't let his sacrifice go to waste, right? Like, you mean that. You say something? No. Nothing. Yeah, but we're not in Susan yet, are we? Huh? What do you mean? Well, we haven't decided who's going in what door. Ah, yes. Yes, that's true. I know this going around already. Let's decide. Okay. You, first Lotus. Which door do you want? I am. Um... I want door number eight. It's the same number as my bracelet number. Got it, you're eight. You're next seven, which door do you want? I'll take seven. I can't get along with that old lady. What? <laughs> what did you just say? Me? I didn't say nothing. You're going to get it next time. All right, who's next? Guess she doesn't like being called old. Junpei, which door do you want? Three. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go to door number three. <laughs> no. You can't. Huh? Why? <laughs> because it's impossible. If we split ourselves in this three and three, then we give up on going to door number three. Why? Please do the math for me. The bracelet number for the six of us are three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There are two combinations that can go to door three with three people three, four, five, or six, seven, eight. That's it. Of course, two teams can't go through the same door. Oh. Yeah? I see. That means one team would get left behind. Correct. That's right. Doesn't happen if we go to door 7 or 8? No. They're fine. We've got three options. Option A. 3, 5, and 8 go through door 7. Four, six, and seven go to door eight. Option B. Four, five, and seven go to seven. Three, six, and eight go to eight. Thanks for spelling this out for us, because it, it's good that somebody um, knows the options just offhand. 
or not offhand, but they figure it out really quick and is like, uh, here, let me explain it for you, dummy. <laughs> Two, six, and seven goes to a seven. Four, five, and eight goes to eight. These are the only options. At least one artist wants to get out of here. Okay. Wait. Mm -hmm. But that means... Five and six can never be on the same team. Oh no, we can't be with June. Again. Well, we could last If we want our six of us to go through a door... And June and I can't go into the same one. June. Have you moved over enough, or do you need more time? Anyway, that's the deal. So I think it's over. June. You've got two choices, seven or eight. You can't choose three. Fine! If you choose three, you're going to be leaving three people behind to die. So, what are you going to do? Seven or eight, time to choose. After thinking of, after thinking of, conclusion was still choose three. <laughs> Take the risk and spend on the baby. Okay, I don't think we've saved it in a long time. Uh, you want to save? Just, I suggest saving it and then taking door number three. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, oops. Um, um, menu, save. Actually, this is probably a good. Um place to save anyway. Cool. Alright, back. I wanna go to door three. <laughs> Alright. Door three. Oh Santa, but I still wanna go to door number three. Screw you guys. <laughs> what? That's nuts. You've gotta be crazy! Screw I don't forget I don't remember which two of you Why the heck you. are you so obsessed with that door? I don't know. I'm just um, <laughs> I'm just curious about door number three. That's all. That doesn't explain anything. <laughs> I've got a reason. I do. For sure. I'd be happy to explain if you just come with me. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> just come over here, Santa. Don't worry. I'm curious about the red. Seven, would you mind us indicating for me? What? Why? Please, just do it. Yep, yeah, uh huh. Happy. Yeah, thanks. Number seven has been added into the red. Okay. Yep. Next is June. Please touch the red just like seven did. Jumpy, what are you trying to figure out? Just, just trust I him don't know. on this one. Just, just trust him on this one. Ah, uh, yep. Yeah, I think. <laughs> Freaking, this is this is fun. I think I might have found another way out. What? What? Really? Now, please, June. Now, please, June. What in the world? <laughs> Alright, the only people who haven't authenticated are Santa Clover and Lotus. Mm-hmm. So, what's your point? You don't get it? Think about it. Mm-hmm. What's some of your numbers and Clovers? Uh, 12. And what's the digital word of that? Three. Which is Santa's number? By the way, I've noticed, what's the number that's currently in the red? Uh, nine, right? Yes, and what would the digital word be if you add three to that? Three, the door's number. There you go. Hey, 
wait a minute, where the heck are you up to? He's pulling the biggest jerk move <laughs> ever. I'm not up to anything. What are you talking about? I'm equating. Waiting for what? <laughs> I wait for the balance to shift. <laughs> Santa or Lois and Clover. Once one of you moves, the others won't have a choice. Mm -hmm. So I'm waiting. You don't. You tricked us. I. <laughs> yep. Hello. Hello. Uh, Xanatos? Hello? Oop! Hello? Where'd you go? Alright, one moment. You're, it says you're there. Hello? 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 Gone. I guess we'll just chill out here and jam to this music until Xanatos comes back. Cause, uh, he got offline, I guess. His internet stopped, I guess. Well, alrighty then. We do love a good, um, internet outage. Yeah. Quietly. So yeah, this, this is uh, one of the, the funnier moments uh, in this game. Um, d well, not funny, but like, just Junpei, like, the Junpei, you could just make Junpei be just this jerk. This absolute jerk to everyone and just screw everyone over. Because he feels like going through door three. Cause he feels like being with June. Cause he's a big ol' simp. Oh wait, you're not supposed to say that on Twitch, huh? Cause he is a, a dude who love June very much. Mm-hmm. 
perhaps in time he will be back. But until then, you're stuck with me. Man, they were at a really cool part too. Now we're just stopping on the action because internet is gross and bad. Sienna's Mayawood. I don't remember who gets it eventually. I'm streaming fine. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. I dropped a couple of frames. That's fine. Usually, it doesn't take this long. Whoop. He went off the call. That's not good. Hello. Please. Come back. Santa shows, please. Santa. Hi. Oh, hi. You're back. Welcome back. I'm going to stop for a few minutes. Yes. It sure did. Can you see the screen? Hello? Uh, yep. Yeah. You should never bleep! You <laughs> flipped us. None of the stuff you're calling on about is all that bleep. Just that. Ew. <laughs> yeah. I don't think so. Didn't I t Didn't I t I don't think so. Didn't I tell you I feel another way I feel? This is it. Right. Why the heck would you do something like this? So he could be with his girl, June. Jumpy! You did this you could just, just so you could go to the same door as June? Yeah, huh? That's it? Yeah, huh? Who's it gonna be? I, I, I love this, this scene because it's like, Junpei can be such a jerk. <laughs> Santa? Oh, no, it's in Clover. No. <laughs> Let's go, Clover. Huh? Eek! Whoa, look at him go. Ah! No, wait. Ah, uh, Santa did it. This is insane. This isn't right. Yes, well, you may be right. But. Here we go anyway. Go. Oh. Bye, Seven. Bye. Bye, Clover and Lotus. No. Uh. You son of a you son of a Junpei! You son of a Junpei. <laughs> That's good. I like that. You realize what you just did? You leave them out there and they can't. Oh, seven is here. Sorry, my bad. Shut it. That's enough. You gotta find the dead or none of this is gonna matter. 
We got less than a minute left. No time for screwing around. Get moving. Hey, hey, you and I are not done, you jerk! Where? Where the heck is it? Over there. It's gotta be behind the door. Dang it, it's pink back in here! Hey, I can't see a thing. No, wait! I found it, a dead thing over here! Whoa! What? The floor's slippery. The floor's slippery. Hey, what are you doing? There's something. Get over there. Quick, get to the dead. What? There it is. Why is there blood all over it? Maybe we'll find out in a second. Pant, pant, pant. Pant, pant, pant. It, it stopped. It stopped. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever get used to doing this. What the? <gasps> what the heck is this smell? It's snake. Hmm. This is fire and I'm gonna puke! You're right, this is... Let's get the lights on first. There's a switch over here. But we can- oh, I don't like that noise. Okay guys, I'm flipping it on. It's blue. Mm. <laughs> <coughs> what? Hey. This is- It looks like an explosion. Just like the ninth man. The detonator wow. in his bracelets with the bomb in his gut. Oh gosh! The bone is coming out of his left arm! It's definitely an open fracture. The face is the worst. Yeah, you can't even tell who it is, Snake. But the clothes are... Is that... Snake? Oh my gosh. Why did this happen? <laughs> what a sound effect. No. No, no. So, what were you saying about not enough people dying? No, Nothing, as far as I can remember. But it was a death game and people weren't dying. Stop! Calm down! And... No, I said people weren't killing each other. I was very specific about that. Ah, oh, yes. Sorry. My bad. Ah! Hey! Please get me out of here! You have to let me out of here! And Zero's just like, no. No, I'm don't. I don't want to do that. No. Stay there. Why are you doing these horrible things to us? What do we didn't deserve this? I don't know. <laughs> June. I just feel like it. Get me out of here, please! Please, just let me out. June. Great. Calm you down. You sacrificed like three extra people and you traumatized June. Good job, Junpei. No, get off me. Let me go. Let me go. 
Jeez, calm down. Uh. Nope, she fainted. Oh, no, she didn't faint. She's just crying. Oh. May he give her a hug. Cabo just watching the whole thing. Like mm. Creeper. Yes, that's a good hug. You're gonna have to draw him on there again. Okay. I'm not going to draw him on there. I'm going to edit him onto there. I don't Fine. have to draw anything. Fine. Yes. We're gonna be fine. It's gonna be alright, June. It's gonna be okay, Kenny. Who, Kenny? It's her. I'll uh, be here with you, okay? She said before that, um, it, it, he said before what her, he remembered her real name. Uh, and so, like, I guess a nickname is Connie or Canny or whatever. Thank you. Thank you so much, Yumpy. Do you feel better? Do you feel better? Yeah. Yes. But I'd like to stay here. For a little while, at least. I want to stare at the blood splatters. Yumpy's body is so warm. What about Kabu? Is Kabu it warm? Is this the path the guy you were watching took? I... don't... remember. <laughs> well, the guy I watched took, uh... took every path, so, like, eventually take every um. path. I assume we're gonna eventually take every path as well, see all the content. Yeah. Um... I was gonna go back. I didn't- I didn't wanna, no. Kill everybody. I just wanted to have a funny death ending. Oh, well. N and now it's keep going, and now we found Snake, and now he's dead. And now I'm like, okay, yeah. too gone too far to go back now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a this is a legitimate route. <laughs> Though, uh. Eh, no, I shouldn't say anything. I'm not sure about it, but... <sighs> if we get to it, I'll tell you, but we might... Yeah, I don't know. Poor Santa. We better get to it! Oh! Yeah, seek a way out. Seek a way out. Next time. Yeah, I'm I was going to say. Banana gram. Banana gram. <laughs>